Welcome to The Colonist, we're going to try and see what this game is all about. My name is Mintries and I'm going to take you on a drive to the campaign mode of this game. And let's see what this game is all about. It's about robots, that's what I know so far, but what will it do? What will they, what can they do? We'll see, let's hop into the campaign mode. And let's see, after countless years of traveling through space, you'll find a habitable planet, all right. I guess that's fun. All right, the story so far, the, by the middle of the 21st century, significant advancements have been made in the field of robotic and artificial intelligence. Science have begun developing self-awareness printing, printable robots capable of sim simulating human needs of sustaining and shelter. All right, so they need a house and a roof and something over their head. Faced with the indef indefinity future of servitude, one group of robots hatched a plan or to create a new life for themselves. All right, so we're kind of we're kind of rebels, I guess. Realizing there would n be no good place on Earth, they could enjoy freedom without persecution. They look to the heavens. All right, so we're going to space. They commandeered the nearest rocket ship and flew out into the darkness of the solar system in the search for a new home where they would be free. All right, so we have some kind of dreamy robots and we're going to kind of be dreamy robots. All right, hello dreamy robot. All right, we have a lot of robots. We copied. All right, tutorial. At last, Terra Firma, we have finally reached our habitable planet, and we can see. We can set our wheels on the ground. Yes. All right. So you got little wheels. You got a lot of energy. We got some wood. So you stole a lot of wood from Earth, I guess. You are a drone bot, Matrius and are in charge of the colony operations. This looks like a good island. Is this an island? Oh yes, this is an island. Ooh, kind of cool. Uh, this looks like a good island to test our anaerobic systems. All right, I guess we are going to do that. We're going to do the basic. We're going to rotate and the other way. Nice done, thank you. And we're going to right click. Uh, oh, right click and drag and move over the world all right we can do that we can screw zoom out and yes we can do the middle mouse yes that's kind of the basics and we got 16 locks all right we got 16 locks flushing and the resource on planet tells you how many locks you currently have stored and how much that number has changed over the last week. All right, so we kind of landed and we placed the locks and that's our lock. All right, cool. This section tells you how many locks you produce and how many are depleted. <clears throat> right, so this is kind of management game. I'm already in, in the cool mood. It does look kind of cool. Sleepy colonist ships. Locks are important construction materials and your colony ship has the basic replication which slowly produces locks to ensure you'll never completely run out. All right, so we have a lock creating rocket ship. That's kind of neat. But you're going to need more, a lot more locks. So let's build a lumberjack hut. All right. First click on the resource panel. And by using the X button, that's kind of strange. First, close the research. Oh, oh, that, yep. Yeah. Oh, stupid me, stupid me. All right, now, flashing building icon. I see no flashing building. Oh, there it is. And that's a lumberjack. It's neat trees. And it's going to produce us two logs a day. All right, cute. Lumberjack hut. I guess it's do need to be close. Can I turn this, rotate this? Oh, I do need to put it in that spot. I want to have it a little bit different. And it needs locks. Wow, how strange. 
Oh man, I'm so bad in reading tutorials. I really am. I need to build a road to it. You have some locks at the colony ship, but there is no route to the Lombardyak house indicating yellow. And now we're going to learn how to build a road. And the road to that. And oh man, can I not decide anything myself? Oh man, I want to make decide myself, but I guess the tutorial is kinda kinda not letting me. We got a lot of robots. I wonder who, who oh they are dropping it at every point. That's kinda neat. Right now it's being watched and or built and we are going to watch it being built. That's a damn primitive thing. All right, we even need to spend energy to that thing. And that's a cool big looking robot, damn. I wonder how they produce energy because I'm, the rocket ship does make energy or does make locks, but it didn't say anything about energy. <clears throat> All right. We are bringing a lot of energy. How am I going to see the energy? The lumber bot has arrived and has headed off work. You may have noticed that another research is delivered. Yes, I did. Click on it. Production. I was noticing about that energy thing. Some bots such as Lombardo need extra power to carry that job out, alright? So how am I going to get energy? The extra power is provided by the energy resource. This panel tells you that Lombardo needs level 1 energy. Alright, cool. But how do I make energy? Because I find that way more important. So I guess we're going to build one new energy thing. This panel now tells you how much how much this costs, all right? So we're going to, all right, now we're going to learn how to rotate. Just what I wanted to learn, way easy. Now, now I need to build a road, I already get this part. Yeah, I'm getting good at this game. And we made two more robots and one little construction robot. So I guess this is game is all about building a most efficient way of uh, the roads. That way you need to be able to transport everything. It's, it's a little, little bit like Transport Tycoon. Change the game speed on that I can do. Then change, change game speed by using Z and X. All right, pause the game by using a space. All right, thank you, we done that now. All right, the resident is finished, but as long as the item above building the house is, it needs something. All right, what does it need? It needs water, so we're going to build something else. This game is definitely educating. All right, we're going to build a well. We can build a well. Where are we going? To, do I have to play? Yeah, I have no free will in this game. I have to build it just the way the makers wanted it to be. So these robots do think they have a free will, but they don't. Select a part. Oh, we're going to use this time the other one. Why? Select a part, building mode, and then build a part. I was selecting the build, power building mode, all right. All right, so we're building a little well and everything is fine and good and something horrible is going to happen. I'm not quite sure what, but we'll see. <clears throat> Damn, you have a horrible life, Waterbot. This this is a horrible life if you have to build water or put the water out of the well all the time. 
All right, well, now we need some fish. We need to make the fishing hut and, ooh, that's kind of looking neat. And, you know, this isn't going to fit, you know? How am I going to build this? Because that's not exactly the same, you know? We need to rotate it more. I'm kind of confused. Oh, we can flip. Oh, I do need to read <laughs> the manual. Oh man, I really need to. It's flipping time. All right, man, that was horrible. I'm ashamed, totally ashamed. And we're going to build a pod to that too. So we get the road and the pod, and I kind of not know the difference between those two. So we're watching how the fishing hut is being constructed. We're going to speed up time because I can. <clears throat> and there's a little fishing robot and we're going to slow back time. Ooh, look how the cute fishing robot. That Fisherbot Merly. They all got names, I guess. Stackbot Annalise. Donetta. Margaret. Chefan. And Lida. Jordan. And Bula. I guess we're all out of energy, yeah? Or we got a lot of stock. The fishing boat is now heading off to fish and will soon bring fish. You have a stone deposit just outside your territory. Alright, I guess we're going to click on it. There is a stone deposit all the way just there. Alright, let's click on it. And we are clicking this stone deposit has a yield of 75. But I need a watchtower, alright. We're going to build a watchtower, I guess. You can choose where to build a watchtower yourself. Oh man, I got some free will now. That's neat. Watchtower. We're going to build a watchtower. Well, I kind of want to build it this way. And do we have a free... All right. Look good. Now you need to connect the watchtower. Oh yeah, I'm good at this. I'm, I can connect the road. I can definitely do that. And uh, let's see, road. I'm going to build a road all the way. And that one. And we're going to use the pod to that one. All right. Look at them work, look at them work. So I guess we need some kind of deposit somewhere because nothing is really working at the moment. The energy is not being used and the wood is now finally being moved, but it doesn't look to go that fast. All right. I must say I do like this cute little island. We're kind of safe here. Oh man, I was really hoping this tutorial would be in the first episode. But we need to speed it up a little bit. Come on, come on, come on, work robots, work, 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 work. <clears throat> Alright, it's almost done, almost done. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah. You're a builder robot. Now I guess we need to put someone in. Ooh, looky looky. You're the watch robot. Uh, while your watchtower is being built, let's construct some f a forestry plant. All right, so I, I need to do something else. In the meanwhile, I didn't pay attention. And we're going to build a forestry because else we don't have any wood left. And we're going to construct a pot to that one. Oh man, I love the word pot. Some English words say I didn't pronounce it right. Oh man, now I'm sounding like, almost like Arnold Schwarzenegger. That That's horrible. Why is there... Allocate 10 forces dials. Alright, so I guess we need to allocate... No, we're not doing, we don't want anything to be removed. How am I going to do that? Let's just pause the game because I'm going way too fast. Well, no. 
How do I allocate? Maybe I need to read the tutorial. You control where a tree bird plants the trees. Follow the yellow alert icon. Yeah. No, I don't want it there. I want this section being built and this section. That's going to be a great forest. All right. Great. Now we've that, got that done. Now we are going to the stone, I guess. Let's uh, unpause the game and let's the forest robot do its job. And we're going to mine. <coughs> I guess, how do I want to have it? This way, I guess. Now we're going to build a little road to that one. Road. And... So, we're going to build a little road and then we're going to do the part. <coughs> and then we're going to speed it all up again. We're going to speed four. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Work, 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 work. Something horrible is about to go and go down. Something needs to happen because this is way too peaceful. Look at all the fish you got. Right, that one also needs energy. Well, we got a lot of energy. <coughs> All right, nice work. You mine bots will now head off to harvest stone. All right, you may have noticed that surface mining also required energy. Yes, I guess that. Click on the energy L1 panel for the demand. All right. I guess there's more demand than there is production. Yes, that's usually kind of the case in these kind of games. So we are going to construct, <coughs> build two more residents. All right, I, we can do that. I can that definitely do that. And I'm going to build a pot, no, a road. We're going to do the road this time. So. <coughs> All right, now we are slowly getting in the surplus. Another tip, you can control plus select the coast to increase your food production. Control plus increase. How do I do that? Oh gosh, nice. The tutorial just went gone. But more resonant means more house, bo house bots needs demand for water and food. All right, that's kind of the usual thing. But another fishing hut one at the coast to increase the food production yes we can do that we can do that so let's build that one there and let's build another road no a uh, pot yes i don't know why i needed the uh the woodcutter bar because we got a lot of wood excellent you have functional colony all right, I don't agree on that, but and your skills are looking promising. That I do agree. When you're ready, it's time to move on somewhere with a bit more space. Yes, let's go. All right, we are still in the tutorial. So, but this is, is a bit more promising area, I guess. Still not agree totally on that, but we are going to build a small manual to require advanced materials, including an iron. And you are going to need to research technology. All right, so we are going to research stuff. I guess the basics that we are going to do is uh, first set up the fishing hub. Ooh, first, though, we need to fish. You need to build a sheep farm. Oh, we don't have any fish here, so we need to... Oh, all right. Uh, sheep's farms can produce enough food for four residents, but they need space. All right, so I guess we did took sheeps on our... Ooh, we got a lot more stuff we can do now. So the first thing, resonant, we're going to build a little resonant house. 
guess I cannot build a resident house. I need to build the sheep farm first. And I cannot pick where I can build it. That's kind of annoying. All right, wait, we do we get to pick the roads? Use the road and the path. Yes, we can pick. All right, so let's do the road, roading. Oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh, we got some storage area. We needed that in the last one. Sawmill. And where, what were we doing? Yes, oh yeah, the roading. Uh, let's build road. Oh, and a pot. And then we get a little sheep area. Right, let's speed it up. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, you are doing great. Now we're going to... Our Lord, you have not expanded your sheep farm. How do I do that? Your sheep farm won't produce at its most optimal rate until you place a fully of 50 patchers. Right, how do I do that? Auto place? All right. Kind of cool. Not what I expected, but... Next. It's time to build a colony on your own. All right, so we're out of the tutorial. And I can always ask help, but we're not going to do that. I guess this is going to be fun because now we need some housing. Yes, let's build some housing, some resident, and we're going to build it on just the way I want it to be. Uh, let's see, I need road here, so we're going to build first two, I guess. Then we're going to need some wood. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Can we do research? No, we cannot. What's this? Sometimes it can be useful to remove a wall that to allow a road. All right, so that's kind of the, the terrain editing mode. All right, now they need water. We need a well. I guess that could be a good place for a well. A road, no, a pot. I want a pot. And I guess we first need, uh, all right, so we are getting the water uh, thing. So now we're making the energy and now we only need our wood chopper, Lumberjack. And Lumberjack is going to go just, I want it to go this way. I wonder if I can, let's first build a road around it because I want to have a pot that way or a road. That way, that's one, and that's two. All right, now we can build a lumberjack, and it's going to be in, no, not a forest, see the lumberjack. So, that's going to be that. <laughs> All right, now we got our lumberjack, and we're getting the wood. And we kind of want the storage area, because I just saw the storage area. I want to build a lot of stuff. Let's first build a watchtower because I want it a little bit more space. So we're going to build a watchtower there and we're going to build a watchtower over there. And we're going to build a new road. Mm, yeah, that's going to be it and we're going to build a pot to that one. Now we're going to build a new road. No new pot. We're going to build it. No, I need a road, not a pot. That, that's what we need. All right. Come on, come on, come on. Yes. All right, now let's build the pot. That way we're going at high speed at the moment. I want to have new watchtowers being finished. I want, I want, I want a lot of things, but I can't have it all. I was looking for the mining thing, but I guess it isn't there. I guess it's, what is this? Stone deposit. Why can't I build, can't we build 
the what's this a workshop let's build a workshop i want to have a workshop don't know what's good for it but we'll see we'll learn along the way that's the way to go and a small monument we need some planks we need some stone and i still wonder why can i not build no we're going to build a large storage base all right we need stone for that and i i can't build stone fishing at farming sheet well lumberjack mining shaft somehow i can't build stone and i don't know what i'm doing wrong <coughs> What do we need? Can mine? Surface mine. All right, so I guess it's this thing. So I could do it all the way. Yeah, I knew it, I knew it. So that's done. How's our energy? Yeah, we need stone. These warning signals are kind of useful. Oh, look at this. I wonder, oh, there's fish. And these are coal deposits. And underground iron ore. Oh, this is looking great. We definitely need to go that way. All right, so we have a stable mining construction now, or stone at least. That means we need stone for this one and we needed stone for that one the little storage space that will come that will come mm, because they're kind of busy so i want a second road and because as you can see they are having a little bit of problem moving things around and this no i don't want a pot i want a road That way we can, what's your problem? Rules, we need to set rules. Uh, there are no resources on the route. Can we set rules? I want, well, I kind of want the meat in store, but also you're doing nothing, add rule. So, all right, so now they're storing it any all right so i can do any that's kind of neat all right what do we need now oh, what does this shop research we need we need something but i don't know what yet we can use construction that's going to take what does this do scaffolding doesn't say what it does, so that's kind of annoying. Construction, stone masonry. So let's start research. I'm not sure what it will do, but we'll see once we've done it. All right, I guess we're doing pretty damn well at the moment. I'm going to slow it down a little bit. And this is going to be it. My first tutorial is done. And yeah, we're kind of going to look in the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If it's your first time here, check out the other Let's Play series. Also, I get a lot of how-to and best unknown indie games. They will pop up after this video. And if it's your first time, also press subscribe button. It really helps the channel. Thank you for watching The Colonist and see you at the next episode.